Life, they say, begins at 60. And indeed, it is the beginning of life for Mr. Olatunji Balogun, who is inarguably the youngest looking 60 year old in town. Mr. Olatunji Balogun is the CEO of Balotech Nigeria Limited and the immediate past president of the Computer and Allied Products Dealers Association of Nigeria, CAPDAN. The Diamond Jubilee celebration of Mr. Olatunji Balogun saw family, friends, and well wishers gather at the Classic Event Center in Ikeja, Lagos, on the 15th of October 2017, to celebrate and usher Mr. Olatunji Balogun into the perfect age of 60. Prominent among dignitaries at the event were former Deputy Governor of Ogun State, Alhaja Salmot Makonjola Badru, brother to Chief Razak Okoya, the patriarch of the Okoya dynasty, Dr. Tajuddin Okoya, and wife, Rashidat Okoya. Gorgeous wife of billionaire industrialist, Are Razak Okoya, Chief Mrs. Folashadi Okoya. His Royal Majesty, Oba Adesheson Ogutayo, the Ajalonu Dua of Ijebuife. His Royal Majesty, Oba Adeyemi Adekeye, the Abekpa of Jogaland in Yawa Kingdom. Veteran Nigerian actors, Jide Kusoko, Odunla de Adekola, among others. The event began with a king of juju music himself, King Sonny Ade, entertaining the guests with good music, after which was the grand entry of the celebrant in company of his beautiful wife and friends as they danced graciously into the arena. <laughs> One of Nigeria's finest actors, Odunla De Adekola, also serenaded the guests with some melodious tunes. <laughs> Tributes to the celebrant, Mr. Olatunji Balogun, were paid as family, friends, and well wishers spoke highly of the celebrant and wished him many more fruitful years ahead. About my dear, very, very close and confident friend. As we all know, Tunji Balogun is a man of many parts. He is a very industrious person. He is a very diligent person. He is a very innovative man in business. In the ICT world, Balotech is well known to everybody. That is a brand my friend, my dear friend, developed. I need to say one or two things. We have been through the canteen together. Even when Tuji came back from the US and decided his business development, we were together. I was a little kid growing up in, in, the, in one of the poorest areas of Lagos, you know, a genuine design. And I remember him attending university way back then in, 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 the, in the United States. He came back home on holidays and he saw me and a bunch of my friends and he said, okay guys, come see me. And it was about 10 of us and the girls gathered. He, he looked at us and he said, come on, come see me. And he showed us all the way to achieve 
everything we wanted to achieve. He assisted pretty much all of us to cross over without checking us anything, without expecting anything from us. And today I can praise 50 to 100 people that their, that their lives have changed as a result of his generosity. He's a guy that will show you the way, that will share with you, that will mentor you. Some of the young guys over here have been the benefits of his mentoring to make sure that you succeed. And um, I cannot thank you enough for what you've done for my life. I cannot thank you enough for what you've done for all the other guys that I know, some of which are here today and some of which are in the United States. I know this is a very, very happy occasion and you deserve it. And I, I can't be happy for you. Thank you very much. Thank you. My very good friend. Judy has such a lovely heart, and I always want that because she's ever ready to help her and ever ready to share anything she has, including in her business um, suggestions. She's ever ready to give you a hint on what to do about your life to improve your life. Judy has a very big heart, and I really, really respect him. He's a very loving father. I was telling him two days ago that I was going to interject his life with one joke, and that is to be loved women. I was in his office one day and I saw a stack of envelopes of names of about 19 people. And I asked, uh, who are these going to? They said they are salary of some staff. And I said, uh, this staff doesn't work here. To my amazement, I found out that Tuti is paying a salary of about 19 people who are not working for him, but just helping them. And I said, this man must be a very good man. Following that, he is the first person that encourages me to come back to Nigeria and visit. After about 30 years when I left this country to the United States of America, I was thinking I was not going to come back. He encourages me to come back and visit, and then judge subsequently. Well, the result of this taking me back to Nigeria is what I am today. The cutting of the birthday cake was supervised by His Royal Majesty, Oba Adesheson Gutayo, as the celebrant was joined by the former Deputy Governor of Ogun State. Alhaja Samot Makonjola Badru and Chief Tony Adeinka. Well, I'm going to recount these So this morning, for this afternoon, I made the sign. I only met the final grace. I will spell this up and call the game. Game in S S U U A short prayer was said by the mother of the celebrant, Alhaja Sikirat Balogun, after which Alhaja Salmot Makonjola Badru proposed the toast.
happy returns of that day. Long life and prosperity. Hip, hip, hip. Hooray! Hip, hip, hip. Hooray! Evangelist Dori Oluwakemi Jacob, popularly known as Oyibo Jesu, was next to entertain guests to some melodious gospel tunes. Thereafter did the King of World Beat, King Sonia Day, thrill guests to tuneful and danceable songs as family and friends took turns to hit the dance floor with the celebrant. <laughs> To wrap up the night, Mr. Olatunji Balogun thanked God for his faithfulness upon his life and appreciated everyone who came from different parts of the world to celebrate with him. He wished them well as they journey back to their destinations. And I thank all of you who are here today. Again, I say thank you. Those of you came from the U.S., I have a lot of my friends from the U.S., there were about 40 of them from New York, from Chicago, from England, from all over the world. So I say thank you to everyone of you. May God continue to bless you and bless you with you. Thank you. From the chairman and CEO Biscan Communications, Prince Bisi Olatilo, it's 60 hearty chairs to Mr. Olatunji Balogun.